Hey, Walter Sorrells back with my continuing series of videos about uh, tools used in the making of Japanese swords and their mounts. So I was talking in an earlier video about the planes or kana that are used to make Japanese uh, scabbards. Now I, would, I talked about planes used on the interior surfaces of the two pieces which are um, used to form together to make the, uh, the Japanese scabbard. Planes are also used to profile the exterior of the scabbard. So it's pretty obvious how you would profile the outer portion of the curve. But what happens is if you get into a curved surface like this and try and plane it off with a conventional flat plane, it, it bottoms out on the corners and you can't get the blade all the way in. So basically a plane like this is intended to make things flat and it's of no use whatsoever on interior curves. So is there a solution to that in terms of planes? The answer is yes and it's this. It's a small curved radius uh, plane so the bottom is just curved. Uh, there's, a, there's a kind of plane like this in the western tradition uh, that's used for making I believe uh, cheer bottoms. Um, same principle, it's just a normal plane, but the bottom is kind of shaved off. So another neat little thing, I made this particular plane myself, um, and uh, very handy for getting those interior curves planed out of the curved surface that you have uh, on the exterior of a saya or Japanese scabbard. Hope you're enjoying this series of videos. Uh, if you did, check out my website, waltersorrelsblades.com, uh, where you'll find lots more videos in this vein, along with plenty of examples of my own work. Also, like my page, Walter Sorrells Blades, on Facebook. Thanks for watching.